फर्स्ट केम द परसेप्शन ए आई विच कुड क्लासीफाई अमंग द इमेजेज ऑफ डॉग्स एंड कैट्स देन वी हैड जनरेटिव ए आई विच कुड जनरेट टेक्सट फ्राम अ सिंपल टेक्स प्रॉम्प्ट और इवन सम ऑफ द इमेजेस एंड ऑडियो एंड वीडियो दीज डेज वी आर रेवलिंग इन रीजनिंग ए आई विच कुड थिंक सेल्फ रिफ्लैक्ट एंड देन गिव अस अ प्रोफाउंड आंसर ओवर द कोर्स ऑफ लास्ट फ्यू मंथ सिंस द डीप सीक मोमेंट वी हैव सीन प्लेथोरा ऑफ रीजनिंग मॉडल्स In this video we are going to install and check out this new reasoning model AM thinking which promises to enhance this reasoning to a next level. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Before we install this model let me give you a very very quick overview. So the thing is that all of these reasoning models especially the deep sea car one or recently released Quen 3 235 billion and these are mix mixture of expert models by the way they dominate all of the leaderboards but they also demand clusters and clusters of high end gpus just to do the inference now what if you need the best dense model which is mixture of expert which could do reasoning at par with these deep seek models but that fits on a single gpu card that is where this am thinking version 1 fills that gap while remaining fully based on open source component they have also shared lot of other technical uh, detail on their model page which i will drop the link in video description let's go and try to get it installed i am going to use ubuntu system and my gpu card is nvidia h100 with 80 GB of VRAM. These are larger models, by the way. First up, let's download this thinking model, and this is going to download the model on our local system. The tools which I'm going to use for this purpose is VLLM with Text Generation Web UI from Uvapuga. If you don't know what that is, just go to my channel and then search with VLLM. I already have. done step by step very easy to follow videos on vllm and how to integrate it with text generation web ui also if you're looking to rent a gpu just like i did on very very affordable price you can go to the website of mass compute and i will also give you a 50% discount coupon and you can rent a gpu and you will find their website link in video's description i also want to thank the sponsors of the video who are agent bot Agent Bot lets you effortlessly deploy a personalized knowledge bot across platforms like Discord, Slack, and others. It is ideal for open source tech communities and startups that provide user support. And I will drop the link to their website in video's description. Okay, so let's wait for this model to get downloaded, and we will test it out then in our text generation web UI. Okay so the model is downloaded let's go to the model page and then you can see that I already have loaded this thinking model here let's go back and start chatting with it so first up i'm asking it to write me a python script for a bouncing red ball within a triangle make sure to handle collision uh, detection properly make the triangle slowly rotate implement it in python make sure the ball stays within the triangle let's run this so it is thinking i will click here so let's check it out and let's also check the vram consumption by it runs so it is consuming over 63 gig of vram so this thinking mo model easily fits on one gpu card and yes i agree one gpu card which i am using is quite big so you would need at least 80 gpu of vram in order to run this model but still if you have used um the deep sea car one the actual big model and quen 32 mixture of expert you know that we have used multi gpu cluster for that but this one while meeting their performance is fitting onto single gpu and if i just quickly go up and read through its thinking it looks quite good already so it is going through all the motions of our chain of thought model where it is understanding what the question is it is checking out various steps drafting and then it is checking its response thinking again and then waiting thinking going for alternate ways and then coming up with some of the steps here so pretty good performance i would say it's not printing out gibberish it's not hallucinating it's not going way too vivid and it is 
now coming up with an alternate method too so let's wait for it to do something and then we will check it out it's been five minutes and it's still thinking and it already has produced a code if i just scroll up here and you will see that it is producing the code doing different iterations while it does that let me talk a bit more about this model because i think this is where these sort of models shine when we have a closer look at their architecture so this am thinking is a reasoning optimized open source model that has been developed by applying a carefully designed post training pipeline to the publicly available coin 2.5 32 billion base model and that shows that dense models at the 32 billion scale can achieve state of the art reasoning performance comparable to much much larger mixture of expert models like deep sea car one and coin 3's own 235 billion moe without relying on private data or complex mixture of expert architectures through rigorous pre-processing of open source training data including deduplication quality filtering and decontamination followed by two-stage post-training process involving supervised fine-tuning and reinforcement learning the model develops strong reasoning capabilities that achieves impressive scores on challenging benchmarks such as ME um, and live code bench so for me this model highlights how thoughtful post training strategies can unlock the potential of moderately sized dense model offering a more deployable and accessible alternative to massive mixture of expert models while maintaining high performance in reasoning intensive task i have mentioned this post training and then in that post training they have used sft and rl or reinforcement learning let me talk a bit more about on that one so when we say a post training that means the process of further refining a pre-trained or base model using targeted data and techniques to enhance specific capabilities in this case reasoning so the post training pipeline consists of two key stages supervised fine tuning and rl or reinforcement learning supervised fine tuning or sft during this phase the model is fine-tuned on a curated data set of high quality reasoning focused prompts and responses that encourages a think then answer pattern helping it develop structured reasoning skills so this is just to develop its reasoning skills and then comes the reinforcement learning phase the model is trained using feedback signals such as success in solving problems to iteratively improve its reasoning strategies and with difficulty aware training to ensure stable and progressive learning so together these stages help transform the base model into a highly capable reasoning model without relying on proprietary data or large-scale mixture of expert architectures so this is what is happening in this am thinking model okay so let's go down to see what is happening seems like it is still thinking so this is a thing with these models they think a lot so this is where i always say that if you have a complex coding problem or a very very profound reasoning problem only then use these reasoning models for day-to-day -day tasks for general purpose uh, ai there is no need to use these models okay so let's wait for this to get finished and we will check out what exactly it has produced it better be good and after 15 minutes i guess or maybe more it has started producing the solution code and i'm not exaggerating anyway let's wait for it to produce the code and we will check it out okay so it has produced the code here so you know what at first class the code looks quite good to me but anyway we will check it out by actually running it this is explanation that it has done this triangle rotation collision so output is very very fine so i have copied this code in this vs code it's the same code and because it is using this pi game math is a native library so we would need to install pi game here so i'll just do pip install pi game Okay, so it's already there and let me now run that app.py wow look at this this triangle is rotating and the ball is also colliding in a perfect manner look at that reflection so this is quite good all the collision ball is not going outside triangle it's so 
therapeutic too to watch it so look i believe exceptionally good model in my opinion takes bit of a time but you know what if we have a complex problem uh, we just want the solution we don't really worry about time in that case it is i would give the model full marks let me know what do you think about this model if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps thank you for watching